16 is fighting for an advanced high school diploma. 16-year-old Mackenzie McGuire wants to take American Sign Language as a foreign language. But her high school, like most, do not offer the course. So the Thompson High 10th grader is taking action to change that. <laughs> Mackenzie McGuire is not letting the fact that she needs cochlear implants to hear get in her way. An excellent saxophone player in the marching band, she is now working towards an advanced diploma. There's one problem, though. She needs to take two years of a foreign language. To learn a foreign language like French or Spanish is extremely challenging. It's hard enough to learn English, let alone bring another language that has different, you know, accents, the word pronunciation is very difficult. So Mackenzie decided to take American Sign Language. The state recognizes it as a foreign language, but Alabaster schools, like most school districts, do not offer a course. There's so many deaf students coming through the um, school system that could use it, and so many deaf students are probably not getting the highest diploma because of the fact that they can't take these foreign languages. Now Mackenzie's mom says the school system is trying to find a solution. If she did it as a um, self-study course, she still would have to have a teacher that would assign her a grade. So that's their initial kind of roadblock for them is how are they going to get a grade assigned. Mackenzie has even started a petition, which has received between 500 and 1,000 signatures so far. Why should we prevent the generations that are coming after me from getting the highest diploma when we have these resources and we can use them to get the sign language as a foreign language class? And give hearing impaired students like Mackenzie the same chance for academic success as their peers. We try to check with both the Alabaster School Board and Thompson High School about McGuire's mission, but both were closed for spring break.